doing today guys? Alex Drayson here with SPU. Uh, one exercise that most trainers take for granted is the push-up. They, they believe that most kids can do a push-up and if they can't do a push-up, they tend not to give them a way in which to do it better. So today we're going to demonstrate our push-up from an elevated position by increasing the angle. You just make it a little bit easier, a little less weight on the hands. It makes it a little easier so kids who are learning the push-up can learn to do it properly. So we're going to do it today from this bar. A couple of teaching points that we're going to go through with each athlete when we do a push-up. One is to make sure that our shoulders are back. We don't want those shoulders to round forwards. Two, we want to make sure the body's in a straight line. We don't want to see any sagging from the hips. We don't want to see the hips going too far away uh, from keeping the body in a straight line. Nice and straight, uh, shoulders, shoulders back the entire time. And then as they go down, we want them to keep their elbows fairly tight. So as they go down, it's going to be to there. Drive it back up. Nice and slowly on the way down, touch. Drive it back up. Make sure those elbows don't come outwards. Keep those elbows in tight to the body. Body's in a straight line the entire time. Okay, those are a couple teaching points for the push-up to make sure the kids learn to do it properly, keep their body in good posture, and really make sure that they're developing strength from the exercise and not creating dysfunction. Thanks for checking in with SBU. Be sure to check out our website at sportperformanceu.com.